All right, welcome back. This one's a short one, so I'm just going to quick redo the audio. As you can see, double timer circuits, circles. Yeah, six of these uh, crystals from last month. We're going to see if we can uh, get some six-star magic out of one of these. And for the first one... We are going to get a three star. That's not the business right there. All right, so number two, we are Hoping for anything better. See a lot of stuff, but... Bam, just taunting today. So, here's where I decide to take a side detour. There's a brief one. I was going to grab a PCH, but I didn't have any. So, heading back to the shard crystals. I'm just going to grab one of them. Almost at 100, so. Just replace that one later. See if this will help encourage get. If I can get a two star out of this, hopefully it will encourage a better opening in the cav crystal and another three star so I'm just heading back there we go oh on this well, uh, if you celebrate it, happy Easter. If not, I hope it's a nice, relaxing evening for you if you're watching us. And appreciate anybody and everybody that watches the videos. Oh, let's see. I still got to jump into the side quest and see what that's all about. Because I've been collecting the keys, I just haven't done anything with them yet. Uh, no. Two more shots. I wouldn't mind him as a six star. I mean, I have him, but I don't have him awakened. I just still kind of holding on to my awakening gem, just because for six star they're still kind of extra rare. I got like fifteen awakening gems for five stars. So if I get a new five star. Can definitely awaken a new one, but six stars. I still gotta be extra choosy with the the gem, especially since it's a, a it's not a class gem. It's a generic, so I can use it on anybody. So, and I got the list of best. Got the community, community that everyone thinks can use the generic on, but I'm still kind of gun shy about pulling the trigger on it. Well, that's going to do it for this one. Thanks for watching.